People are thinking, what the hell are people doing on stage? Dancing and clapping and doing this and doing this. Do you know why we do that? Because when we play these games, it requires you to get out of your comfort zone. I see some people sitting like, you know, at the back, it's kind of like, oh my God, it's like, it's like this. You know what? Sometimes to do some big deals, do you have to be out of your comfort zone? Yes or no? Yes, absolutely. You see, the big thing is this. I see a lot of people going into property transactions. And here's the thing. Here's how you know when you're going to be successful. Would you like to know? Would you like to know? Okay. So I can apply this to any, every single person's situation right now in this room. In life, we either have a problem with money, relationships, or our health. One of those three areas. Okay. Now... This might be your, this is what we call the comfort zone, okay? Now, the interesting thing is this. We only go from here to here. And the problem is when we get to the edge, we get scared, and then we come back. I mean, that's just the natural human instinct. Now, think about this for a second. Every time we go outside of the comfort zone, okay, the answer to any single problem you have right now lies outside of your comfort zone. I'm going to say that again. Every single problem you have, you're facing right here, right now in your lives, the answer to that problem lies outside of your comfort zone. Okay? And when you get outside the comfort zone, remember I said before how if you change and you get a breakthrough in one of your areas, everything else changes because that breakthrough shows up in every other aspect of your life. Let me give you an example. If, let's just say you are where you are now, and let's just say you get into really, really good shape, okay, and you train for a marathon, okay, you train for a marathon, you go to the gym. In business, do you need a lot of energy, yes or no? In business, do you think you're going to hit some roadblocks, yes or no? We've got to get our energy through it. And people say, John, you've got so much energy. Do you always have so much energy? I don't just wake up in the morning and go, and start running. I don't do that. Sometimes I wake up and I really do not want to do the things I, I need to do. But sometimes we have to do what's necessary. We have to do what's what? Necessary. So this person next to you says, sometimes we have to do what's necessary. 